Hey buddies, some nuts guy here. Hope you're having an awesome day so far. In this video, we are going to teach you guys the secrets of the spider room. And uh, you know, there's actually quite a bit of good loot in here. You do have things like the compressed netherrack blocks or compressed blocks, generally speaking, that you can often find around the bottoms or around the midpoints. So you can see them in the in the spider eggs here. So you can often just vein mine these. And, uh, and get a good amount of compressed blocks from these. But these spiders also will have compressed blocks on the inside as well. So you see here we got a good number of compressed blocks there. And then the big boy down here. You're going to have a decent number inside of him as well. So you can get a lot of compressed blocks here. And these are really good for your altar recipes. You know, when you're getting an absolute buttload of diorite or clay or andesite, whatever the case may be. This is a really good room to, to look for if you know that you need compressed blocks for your altar recipes. Also, this is something that not a lot of people know, is that there's these gilded chests up here. There is always at least two vanilla chests and two gilded chests up here. Normally more like three or four vanilla chests with these two gilded chests. And they're often in a place where you can vein mine them as well. So you can vein mine those and those. And, uh, and yeah. Happy days. So that is the majority of the loot that can be found in the spider room. Uh, I don't think there's usually anything else. Uh, and then obviously you want to double check the bottom, see if there's any altars or anything like that down there as well. Guys, that is the spider room and the loot that you can get from this room. And it's actually pretty decent, you know. I've definitely saved myself hours of farming time with regards to when I get recipes that require 7,000 granite. You know, we've got some, we've got some compressed granite over there. So, uh, so very good room to stack up these blocks for your future recipes. And, uh, and some hidden loot up at the top. You know, if you have a jetpack or you can mega jump up there, you can quite quickly grab that loot and go very quickly as well. Uh... Alright guys, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more videos like this, consider subscribing. I go live on Twitch every day except Monday and Friday, and it'll be great to see some of you guys there. I also run a Vault Hunters SMP off of the Twitch channel. If you'd like to join that, you need to join the Twitch server, uh, the Twitch channel. Earn 3,000 channel points, and that will allow you to unlock the whitelist for the Vault Hunters SMP server. Alrighty, guys. Hope you have an awesome rest of your day. Take care.